All right, welcome to the first bonus video for Stokey. I'm planning on releasing one of these just about every two levels, just to cover anything that I missed in the regular playthrough. For instance, here I am on level one, where I somehow managed to still miss two rooms. I realized later that I didn't just miss these rooms when I was recording for the LP, but during the millions of times I played this first level, I can't remember ever going into these rooms. Not that there's anything particularly useful inside them. There's a, a root, a gold coin, a skull, and this other little room, which requires the gold key to unlock it, has a non-functioning ant pipe in it. And a blue healing potion in the wall. And that's it. Well, there's nothing else worth showing off in the first level. So I thought I'd take a quick look at the demo for Stokey. The demo contains the first level, and is laid out completely identical to the real game. But there are some minor differences. For instance, the music that they start out with is different. I think this music is used in the full game as well, but I still prefer the more disquieting music that they used for the final game. Aside from that, it's noticeable that there's quite a lot less healing roots lying around in the demo. So I think they might have added a few more after playtesters complained. The most notable difference about the demo, though, is that it sometimes plays some very loud sound effects that appear to be meant to scare you. The only problem is that they're not the slightest bit subtle. They get triggered either when you're attacking an enemy or when you're rummaging through a pile of something on the ground. And I must say I'm really glad that they took them out of the final game. I really would not have enjoyed stuff like what sounds like someone snorting in your ear. The sound of thunder despite me being miles beneath the ground. Something that sounds exactly like the trams pulling up outside my house. And I don't know what that's supposed to be. One more difference with the final game. In the demo you can actually break this kind of table. In the final game you cannot. I have no idea why they took that out. Alright, that's it for the demo. Let's move on to level 2. What say we get a little less polite with Wahooka the Great? Wahooka the Great. Yeah, looks like he doesn't care for it. I cannot stand to be around your foolishness anymore. Do not enter me when we meet again. The Sharkas on level 2 are a bit more talkative than the ones on the first level. In several places when you retreat far enough, they will sling a taunt your way and go back where they came from. This Shaga place, you goes away! Leave here! Yeah, don't you come back! <laughs> go away! Death to you! Well, let's see if Wahooka forgives us after a while. So insignificant worm. You think I will just forgive you for your rudeness? <laughs> You will have to trust me. But believe me, I want you to succeed in your quest. What? You know of my quest to save Thera? Of course. I am the great Wahooka. I know everything. Bring me some trinkets, and I will share just a tiny portion of my infinite knowledge with you. And never assault me again. It's funny that they inserted such an elaborate conversation just for the trigger-happy players among us. It's almost impossible to end up in the sewers without Farley by your side, because you get the key to the sewers one door away from him. But if you consciously chose to leave him behind, conversation in the sewers happens a little bit differently. Long dead. Not in this miserable wet corner of hell. 
Even big old grass is a different line for you. Master's told grass that you be here. Die, Humi! Give them to me. Give them now. Oh, I'll give you something, all right. It is your fortune that you throw away, human. All right, so Wahooka forgives you the first time, but what about the second time? Do you have something for me? Good riddance. No, if you hit him twice, he will not show up on the level anymore. Good riddance. That's all the bonus material for these two levels. See you next time when we head into the Underlands.